The key to solving this problem is getting to that point, that point where you feel really good with a woman, you feel confident, comfortable, the moment you walk up. Then you won't need the online dating anymore. So in this video, we're gonna talk about why some guys are really good at meeting girls online or really good with women on dates, but they say when they approach, they can't get a girl attracted to them at all. They can't get a date. It never goes right. And I get this question all the time and I kind of really want to address it because the answer is much simpler than you think. You see, guys that are good online and meeting, and then, and then they, uh, they meet women, let's say out of the coffee shop or a, bar, or a bar for a date, or they take her out to dinner on a date, um, but can't seem to meet a girl approaching is really a guy that's probably not very good at the first 15 minutes of interaction. Five, 10, 15, three minutes. See, what happens is when you're on the street and you approach a girl, you've only got 30 seconds, three minutes, five minutes, somewhere in that range, probably more on the shorter side of that range to get a girl's attention or she's moving on. She's losing interest. You're walking up, you're saying, here I am, hi, and I wanna get to know you. You're not present, you're nervous, you're in your head, your head's cocked sideways, you're like, ah, because your nervous system's freaking out, this girl might reject me, I'm afraid of being rejected. And what happens is you don't have the time to self-correct. But when you're really good at online dating, you're really good at getting women on dates from online dating, you've got them trapped. You've got them trapped for um, maybe 30 minutes maybe an hour, that's plenty of time for your nervous system to calm down, for you to relax, for you to get more confident. Maybe you start out a little bad, but she's committed to hanging out with you for a while. So 10 minutes later, when you start to calm down, that connection starts to happen. And when that connection starts to happen, she's suddenly like, hey, this guy's pretty cool. The key to solving this problem is getting to that point, that point where you feel really good with a woman, you feel confident, comfortable, the moment you walk up then you won't need the online dating anymore. The moment you say hi, or within a few seconds, 10 seconds, 20 seconds, a minute, because if you don't, she's gonna walk away. She's only gonna give you so much time. And that's the real key to solving this problem. So what I find is that men that are really good at online dating, that have figured it out and have gotten good at it, are really good at marketing. They're really good at presenting themselves in a powerful way. And they like that because of all the, uh, because they go in with a sense of confidence built up from their online profile. You need to learn to create that same sense of confidence within yourself before you even meet a woman. You see, on some level, if you have trouble with approaching, you have a fear of being rejected. You have a fear of not being good enough. And the online environment covers that. It, 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 it kind of gets you past that. And so in my opinion, I really am almost more interested in meeting women the real old fashioned way. You see, online is great, but part of why I'm here at Fearless is to learn to really love myself, to not need validation from others, to not need to buy time to be myself. And that's what it's really about for me. So I've never been super interested in online dating. Some people are, some people love it. Some people don't even wanna change this part of their life. If that's you, that's great. But if you wanna change this part of your life, you wanna make a big shift, then it might be time to turn off the online dating and face these stories once and for all. That's gonna take a commitment. That's gonna take a period of time. That's gonna take a commitment to working on the first 30 seconds, three minutes, five minutes of an interaction and learning to relax, be playful, be fun, learning to let go of your need for validation in that period of time and learning to welcome that part of yourself that, that can become free from outcome, that doesn't need the woman to like you for you to be a solid, connected man. And you can do that. We have plenty of videos on all of these topics here at Fearless. I'm not gonna go into them now, but now that you understand the problem, is this something you really wanna change? That's the first step. And if it is, you can go through the fearless videos and you can see all the videos we have on approaching. You can see demos of how women, how men act weird in front of women when they first walk up and it takes them time to relax. And you can see how we break that stuff down. If you want personal attention, you can come to a Fearless Men Live or a Fearless Experience where we really break that stuff down. 
Because for me, it's always been more about building real confidence and real self-love than it's ever been about just getting women. That's what's important. That's why this channel exists. That's why this company exists. So with that said, I hope you liked this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and uh, make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And also put a comment in the video. What, uh, what way do you meet women right now? Do you use online? Do you, do you approach? Are you ready to commit to a period of time really working on your approach skills, getting good with that energy so you can let go of all that fear and even let go of the online platform and move beyond it? And if that's you, I definitely want to hear from your comment. With that said, remember, only the confident really.